a lot of people have been asking why I stuck with uh, voting for Senator Cruz. I was the, uh, I guess you could say, the lone holdout. Um, in the 16th Congressional District, I should back up. Uh, originally, I ran for voting delegate, and I told people from the beginning, from the Lancaster County Republican Convention forward, that I was committing to the Cruz campaign, that I would be running as a voting delegate, and would be bound to Senator Ted Cruz. Uh, Senator Cruz appealed to me from day one in this race, and uh, I'm a person of my word. I say what I mean, I mean what I say, I follow through on what I'm going to do. I ran into considerable resistance all through the campaign, but uh, in the final analysis, when you look at the primary totals in Lancaster County, I was the highest vote getter for the voting delegate position, and I got more votes for that than Donald Trump did for president. And uh, while I had people complain to me, challenge me, beg with me, plead with me to follow through and vote the will of the people, I said, well, I am voting the will of the people. In Lancaster County, Donald Trump won with 44%. That's a plurality, not a majority. And I said, I am voting with the will of the people. I'm voting and representing the 56% who did not vote for Mr. Trump. And uh, I carried that through all the way to the convention. It would have been easy for me to change my vote. I had no illusion. I knew that Senator Cruz had suspended his campaign. Uh, he, in effect, dropped out. But I followed through and kept my word. It was that simple. Uh, Chairman Gleason called me forward, and uh, we had a nice little chat. And I must say, he was very professional. Uh, he implored me to reconsider. He uh, asked me, please, to... to you know, he really wanted to see a unanimous vote on behalf of the Pennsylvania delegation, and I get that, and, and I, I understand that. But again, in the final analysis, I made a commitment, and I said, uh, I'm a person of my word. It's as simple as that. Uh, it would have been easy to change, and yeah, it would have been fun, and would have been swell to deliver that unanimous vote, but that's not what I said I was going to do. That's not what I ran on, and uh, we live in a day and age when that's what people are fed up with politicians and people who run for office who say one thing and do something else. That would have made me no different than anybody else. Even